Here I have a brand new iPhone. You can see that's a 0 0.4, 0 0.4, 0 0.05. So it's just been updated with iTunes to the 1.1.4, .1 the latest firmware out there. Um, just to show you, this is a locked phone. You see the lock there, and all I can do is emergency calls. It has the AT&T SIM card in it that came from the store. So I'm going to put in this T-Mobile SIM card here. I just take a paper clip, put it in the little hole in the top, and it makes it pop out there. So I'm going to take out this AT&T SIM card here, just push it out. And I'll put in this new, or this one I already had I've been using. This is my T-Mobile plan. So I just put that in. Can't put it in the wrong way since it has a little tab there. And I'll just slide that back in there. So now the phone is going to complain about not having an activated SIM card. But it doesn't matter because we're about to unlock it. So it's still unlocked. It just has my T-Mobile SIM sitting in it. Now all I need to do is I've downloaded, or you can get this download from unlockiphoneotb.com and it's called the one click solution so this is the download here and it is just that uh, for Windows or Mac I'm using the Windows version and I'm just going to do the one click here and let it run so it's going to go through the unlock process it's also going to activate and jailbreak and the jailbreak will also put in um, the installer and the BSD and all that good stuff. Now, if you're not familiar with these terms, what that means is it's going to let me install third-party applications, whether it's uh, media, music, videos, emulators, um, and this is at your own discretion, whatever you want to install. So it'll allow you to do that. So it's going to go through the unlock here. I'll let it run in real time. This should take about two and a half, three minutes once I've started the process. So some advantages that you get from using this unlock. Um, like I showed, I have a T-Mobile SIM in there, so I'm going to be able to use my pre-existing T-Mobile plan. I don't have to worry about cancellation fees or anything, which are quite expensive. I can just stay with the same plan. I don't have to update or re-sign on another two-year contract with anyone. Uh, not even AT&T. It's going to activate the phone without AT&T. It's also going to, um, like I said, it works on Windows or Mac. This will work for all the different firmwares, whether I have the oldest or the newest. And you can update to the newest with iTunes before using it, which is what I did, which is at this time 1.1.4. Uh, this will let me use it around the world. So any GSM SIM card I can put in there anywhere in the world. It will work fine. Um, as long as it's a GSM network so if you can't get a GSM SIM card you'll have to ask your network provider whether or not you can um, it works perfectly fine with iTunes it'll work with uh, the 4 gig, 8 gig or 16 gig iPhones and like I showed just click the one button and it'll do all the work for you there's really no way to do this the wrong way so if you're not very good at computers you don't need to be afraid because it's about as simple as you can get, just one click to do it all. And it's going to let me use YouTube, and the Wi-Fi, Google Maps, everything that's originally on the iPhone. It's also going to give me all the third-party apps. And these are at your own discretion. I don't recommend you install all of them. Um, it'll let you do such things that might be illegal, such as uh, putting in emulators or putting in... Uh, ways of getting free data plans from your provider. So the uh, the phone's unlocked now, and just to show you, uh, it says T-Mobile there. Let's go ahead and try it out. I use my other phone here to dial in. So I'm calling up now. And there's the incoming call. So just a couple minutes, things unlocked, it's working fine now. I can make calls, you can hear the reverb on it. 
if I go back to the home screen, you'll see I have the installer there. So I just need to get to a, a free local Wi-Fi and I can start using the installer application. that will let me put in all the third-party application uh, games, media, video. If you uh, want to do illegal stuff, which I don't recommend, um, don't do anything like get the software that gives you the free data plans or gives you the emulators. Um, the unlock itself is perfectly legal as long as you don't install any illegal things through the installer. The, the DMCA approves unlocking the iPhone to use it on any carrier you choose. So that's a perfectly legal process. And that's the unlock. And once again, that unlock, I downloaded it from unlockiphoneotb.com. It's just the, the download button there. And the moment you click on it, the, the download starts. So it just takes a couple seconds to download, or a couple minutes to download, and then even quicker to unlock it. Like I said, one button. I believe anyone could handle this. All right, thank you.